Hi guys, if you do your makeup only to have it look melted off a few hours later, today I'm gonna to show you some tricks to help it look fresh from day to night. I'm Laura and as a former makeup artist, I love sharing easy style and beauty tips that help moms feel their best. Okay, so on days you know you need your makeup to last all day, make sure first to exfoliate your face, including your lips, and of course, moisturize for a clean and smooth base. If you do one thing, use primer. It helps makeup from being absorbed into your skin and it really holds it in place. Now different primers do do different things. The one I use every day is extra hydrating, but the one I'm using today actually blurs fine lines and pores. I also use a separate one for my eyelids, which really helps my eyeshadow stay on. Next, the face. So the trick to applying foundation is to dampen your sponge first. That way the makeup is not absorbed into your sponge, it's actually making it onto your face. This trick also leaves you with a more natural, less cakey finish. Next, you're gonna go in with your concealer. Remember to use that damp sponge again. And when you're going in under the eye, you're gonna wanna go out and up rather than down to keep it from creasing. Next, set with powder. So your foundation and concealer will wear off if you don't top it off with the setting powder. So take some onto a powder puff and really pat it down onto the oily parts of your face like your forehead, chin, and nose. Remember, do not rub it in, just tap it on. You're gonna to wanna to do your under eye too, but bring back that damp sponge because it's gonna keep it from creasing. Oh, that looks like I did a face plant to some flour. <laughs> it's all part of the process. You said, do I look pretty? <laughs> now we let everything sit for about five minutes. This is called baking, for real, that's what it's called. The heat of your skin is absorbing the powder and locking everything in. Then use any medium-sized brush to dust it off. How's it looking? Good. Very good job, Sid. So from here, you can go in with your blush, highlighter, whatever else you like to do, and we'll set that stuff in later. Next, the eyes. Opt for a liquid eyeliner for longer wear, and for extra smudge insurance, you're gonna wanna take a tiny brush and just go over that line with some matching eyeshadow. And to really hold that curl in your lashes, take a blow dryer to your eyelash curler for about five seconds. Be sure to wait until it's warm but not hot to curl them and follow up with some waterproof mascara. Number five, lips. So even long wear lipstick can smudge, so what I like to do is add a couple coats of blush on top and it really lasts all day. And finally, setting spray. This is like hairspray for your face and it really does make a difference. Spray it about six inches from your face, just a few times for a light and even coat. And I've found it's really helpful to fan your face right after to avoid it from leaving any spots. All right guys, that's it. Now hopefully these tips will help you keep your face on and looking fresh all day long. This is not coming off, not even my kids can mess this up. I'll link everything below and I'll see you next week. Bye guys.